live on there. Let me see here. Get a drink. I would say my check, but I don't know. My check, my check. Alright, so my mic is working. Refresh the th pay stream page real quick. Make the game in a tells on Borderlands. I know it doesn't say that. Most likely. Probably just doesn't say anything, actually. Sorry, I know mean, it takes a while. It always takes forever to set up stream, but fuck it. Here to my intro now. So, oh, what is up, Rocks of the Rock Nation? Your fellow Rocker X, Rocker X, and I am back with another episode of Tales from the Borderlands, aka episode four, whatever the fuck it's called. I don't know. Basically, we just finished episode three not too long ago, like a few minutes ago, on stream, and I don't know what the fuck this is. It does say I'm streaming tells in Borderlands now. That was my phone going off. Said I just heard it again because stream feedback. Yeah. My chat reload back up because I move stuff around. Gotta play. Chat loaded back up. I already said last night we finished episode two. Just a few minutes ago, we saw three. Catch a ride. Now we're moving on to episode four. Escape plan Bravo. Or Bravo. Everyone say it. Bravo, Bravo. Same difference, isn't it? Make sure I, I'm on episode four. Yeah, episode, restart episode three. Nope. Episode four. Yes, escape plan Bravo. Hopefully, this one isn't a bit of a, like, oh no, they're dead. Fuck me. Fuck life. <laughs> the darkest moment in any hero's tale usually comes just when things are finally falling into place. Our unlikely heroes have discovered the unfinished, top secret project of the doomed Atlas Corporation. The Gortis Robot. Searching for the robot's missing components made the dream of the vault seem closer than ever. Even sure though was. the former middle manager was still haunted by the demented ghost of Hyperion Power. Destroy that body while it's still young. Unfortunately, any dream can quickly turn into a nightmare. That is true. This nightmare's name was Valerie. Fortunately, Valerie's killing spree was interrupted when another dangerous adversary was suddenly revealed as a powerful ally. Now, supported by a legendary gladiator, their search continued through the icy wastes of the borderlands to a forgotten Garden of Eden. There, they found another piece of the Gortis robot, as well as the last surviving man on the Gladiator's murder bucket list. As she prepared for revenge, the con artist intervened. That was the moment that Valerie struck. Outgunned and outmaneuvered, the con artist and Valerie man were forced to surrender. Now, mm -hmm. they were working for Valerie. 
and their first job was likely to be their last. Well, fuck us, right? Shelter. Looks like we're in for some showers. Oh, awesome. Yeah, let's let's do that. Can't wait. Are you thinking? It looks like you're you're thinking. That suit he's wearing. It looks familiar, but I I can't place it. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. What the hell is this guy getting out of all this? I can't figure it out. This Endless arch down memory lane. There's got to be a reason for it. He wants a vault. Why else do Gordas pieces looking to strike it rich? Aren't uh, aren't you kind of you know vault hunting now? <laughs> yeah, that's what I did there. Yeah. I feel like we should do something. If we get to those hills, maybe we could lose him. Yes, I don't know. What's he gonna do? Huh? Shoot us both? Don't be stupid. He has a gun. So he clearly needs us for something if he wanted That's to. Right, his eyes are different color instead of blue. It's uh, I think all those shots to the head handsome head Jack actually take top. over. That hasn't helped. I'm making a break for it, and you should too. Remember. So either way, she's gonna work with him or not. But it looks like a handsome Jack takes over. That sounds stupid. It's not stupid. It's it's genius. All right, going on three. One. Three, go! Taken. And you were stuck under Valerie's gun. It was a rocket launcher, okay? Even for her. Oh, fuck. Train again. Vaughn? Vaughn! Shut up. Hey! Stop it! Please! Not so rough. Sorry, boss. The nerd is gone. Some old dude with crazy hair ran off with it. That's okay. We've got what's important. There, there, little one. No need to be upset. I'll answer your questions. Please, just promise that you won't hurt anyone. Of course, dear. I don't want to hurt anyone that's being cooperative. Gordas. Hey, look at me. It'll be alright. Now. Tell me about the Vault of the Traveler. The, the Vault of the Traveler teleports all over the universe, only staying in one spot for a few minutes before blinking away. But once I have my last piece, the beacon that's up on Helios, I can summon the Vault and hold it here. Then you collect treasure or something. What does the beacon look like? <laughs> collect treasure or something. I... Oh... But I'll know it when I see it. That's what happened with peace. Well, that's some exciting news. Thank you, Gordis. You're... I like how this is Gordis, but it's welcome. like Gordis. Can I get away from you now? Of course. <laughs> Look at you, Fiona. Just so angry. <laughs> is this about Athena? You're feeling guilty. That's what's Leave her alone! You can't blame yourself. You couldn't fight fair, could you? Had to call in some goons. 
I wouldn't call Frick and Morty that. They're highly trained vault hunters, and they deserve your respect. Now listen up. Under normal circumstances, your rotting corpses would already be getting torn apart by skags right now. But these are not normal circumstances. And with that last piece being on Helios, I can't think of a better crew than a pair of Pandoran con artists and a Hyperion stooge to figure out a way to get it for me. Well, shit. What do you say? And I'll give you a hint. The only right answer is... What's in it for us? What's in it for you? Well, for starters... <gasps> things like this will stop happening. Does that work for you? Or do you think we should negotiate more? Hey! What's it gonna... Don't give in. I'm fine. Hey, I said you wouldn't hurt anyone. Stop. Yes, whatever you want. Please. Yeah. No, we're still not going to kill. Leave her alone. I'm glad we were able to work this out. You didn't have to do that. Yeah, you shouldn't have given in. Shut up. What the hell is wrong with you two? We've got principles. Son, be a dear and help them come up with a plan. Yes, ma'am. That's where you kill him. To be fair, unless they took her hostage, they could easily I'm get away. You, it's not possible. We can't do this. That's not an option. Neither is getting ourselves killed. One way or another, we're gonna figure out how to pull this off. Okay, let's start with how we're gonna get there. Well, this isn't hey, the first on, time we've on, had to get creative. Everyone we'll, calm down, we'll find okay? Our... Thank you. All right, guys, it boils down to this. Somehow we've got to get to Helios, infiltrate Hyperion, and steal Gordis's vault beacon. Sorry, that was breakfast. <clears throat> Sorry, without getting ourselves killed. No shit, moron. I just said that like 30 seconds ago. Everyone knows what we have to do. We're just... Trying to figure out how to do it. Okay, okay. If you stop being so negative, maybe we can. How's your tum tum there, buddy? That'll one. teach you to hit the I taco do, truck. Right now, I don't see how that's gonna happen. Wow, you we'll got the magic, kid. The they should there bottle the so stuff. Call it weak wrong. sauce. And that's why we have to drill down Actually, on every I could use your help. Mission. Yeah, so of course you could. I'm not the one Is that a yes or no? What? You think old Jack would leave his meat buddy hanging? Great. I honestly don't know how to answer that. The reality All right, is okay. I know we've had our differences, and I'll admit I can get pretty grouchy when I don't get my own way. But try to maximize our chances, okay, here's I'm ready to bury we don't go. All right. You know we it, it's a metaphorical hatchet, Fine. especially because I know I don't really have any hands right now. Which is a real bitch, I tell you what. You help us out, and you can consider that hatchet good and buried. Then it's a deal, Daddy-o. Stick with a verbal agreement, shall we? What I'm saying is this, I got your beacon somewhere in my office. Get in there, and it's mission accomplished. Okay, his baby. old office. I just don't see how we're gonna do this. You don't get that beacon. You're all as good as dead. You're not helping. Oh, great. Captain Obvious wants to speak. Uh, I believe I have information that is relevant to your interests. Is in Handsome Jack's office. You pulled that out of your ass. Well, check it out, smart guy. Run it by Gordis. Fine. Hey, put the little robot on. Listen, you got access to a map of Helios? I do. See if you can focus your scan for the beacon in Handsome Jack's old office. Let's see what we have here. Enhance? Oh, so you can say it. You're shitting me. I wouldn't know how. That whole sector must be crawling with guards. <laughs> you see me? I wouldn't know how. Possibly break in. Man, how many people you got to kill to get enough? I get that you're scared. The yeah, I am too, but working together, I think we have a shot. Great. Do we have a shot, really? Sign me up. I don't know how we're gonna get through this. Teamwork. That's how. 
Then you better have a damn good plan. Oh. It's killer. Behold! Dios. Okay. Now how do we get there? Dios is in... Obviously. We have one lying around. Shooter. He said we could call him anytime. Well, you got yourself a rocket man, miss. Chuck. And then it's off to Helio. Pandora, we have lift off. Before we dock, I'll tell Abed we've arrived. She'll help us. Why not call her now? Well, the less she knows, the safer she is. Yvette, we're back. Awesome, Reese. You're a hero. I'll tell the guards to let you through. At ease, soldier. Then I'll disable the security system. I like how all this is just like planning I am a living god Fiona you'll take Sasha and Gordis and go to the hub of heroism now up on Helios Jack's office is a museum hallowed ground not even Vasquez had access looks like the only sure access is the VIP tour meet your new tour guides From there, we'll get into Jack's office, where I'll- <laughs> hang on. Uh, you'll need me for that, obviously. Once inside, Gordis will ID the piece. Wow! This place is huge! This way, please! And to the victors go the spoils. Told you. <laughs> Killer plan. Wait a minute. How are you gonna pull any of this off? Hyperion wants you dead. Then I better go as someone else. Vasquez. And for the grand finale. Oh, did you strike last skies? But Hyperion's gonna want proof that Reese is dead. We'll use Vasquez's body. They'll never know the difference. This could actually maybe work. So, I guess all that's left is pitching the plan to Valerie. All this She'll planning. Go for it. And getting me to Old Haven. And I'll go no, to Scooters. Wait a second. Hmm? So, how did you figure out the pieces in Jack's office? Don't tell them, Princess. They'll sabotage the whole freaking mission. It just came out of nowhere. Don't do it. <laughs> no, I have to. Tell worse. Okay, team. Um, prepare to have your own. <laughs> and some jackets in my head. Oh, damn it! Did you just just allow me to explain? Hey, when I plug his ID drive into my head port, I kind of accidentally uploaded an AI version of Jack into my brain. But, but it's cool. It's cool. I've I've got everything under control. Kind of. What? You had that murdering son of a bitch in your head all this time, and you didn't tell us? You asshole. And we thought August was a prick. <laughs> okay, <laughs> if Jack's really in there, I want to talk to him. You know, just give him a piece of my mind. Yeah, that's not happening. But he'll only talk to me. Oh, how convenient. Well, that went over well. Even your oddly ripped moron sidekick took it better. Anyway, you know how it goes. Snitches get stitches. I just made that up. It's no, you don't. So wait, when you fell off that balcony back there, that was Jack? And here I thought of you as a friend. I'm not one to say I told you so, but... No, uh, you kind of have I to tell him. So. Oh, good times, huh? Have fun cleaning up your mess. As you have every right to be angry, okay? I, I would be too. I should splatter you all over this fan. I should have told you earlier, I get it. That you're Hyperion scum? Let's just say for argument's sake that you didn't mean to be a lying scumbag and that you understand that you should have shared what is an incredibly vital piece of information. So far, so good, I guess. Even if we could somehow trust you again, how can we trust Jack? No more lies. You need to level with us from here on out. No. Guess what? Frankly, no one knows Hyperion better than Jack. So, you think he'd be helpful? I think we'd be crazy to go in without him. 
without hope. All right, Valerie signed off on the plan. Reese is going with Finch. Rest of us are follow point to get the seat. Thanks, Macy. Oh, damn. Add something. Christ, it's gonna be a long one. Up there. Ain't got oh, lead. Complete you. chapter one of episode four. Just hurry up. I don't like being alone with this thing. <gasps> but I like you so much. <laughs> Because he screwed him out of a lot of money for those caravans. He could be angry. And I've heard stuff about what he did to the Zafford clan. He's a pretty jolly guy for someone who just buried another man alive. Just be honest. He likes us and he's a, he's a decent guy. Yeah, I mean, he'll probably jump at the chance to build something cool, right? My two favorite gals. Come to see your old sponsor, huh? How go the race? I know you sure like going fast. <laughs> Wait, no, not like you're a fast woman or. Oh, shoot. Scooter, great to see you. Just an absolute pleasure. Every time I get to see your face, just. <laughs> go on. <laughs> nah, you don't have to go on. I know my face is about as appealing as a dead dog. Somebody whacked a few times with a tire iron till it pop. But anyway, it's great to see you. What can I do you for? Not saying that I want to do you or nothing. No, it's, well, not that I'm saying I wouldn't either. Scooter, we are going to space. What? I love space. It's like my fourth favorite thing behind tacos, trucks, and heavy <laughs> eye contact. That all sounds great. Only problem is funding. No, don't worry about it. Valerie will pay for whatever we need to get to Helios, get the Gordas piece, and get out. I understood exactly half those words. Let's do it. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. When I said that there was only one problem, I meant that there were two. Because, look, I know a lot about cars, and I know a lot about engines. But rockets are right out of my purview. My business partner knows rockets like you wouldn't believe. But she's, uh, she's a little out of sorts. Janie Spriggs, Athena's girlfriend. Uh-oh. I don't know if she's in much shape to help with the rocket stuff. Oh, she's shit. like that since she heard about a couple vault hunters nabbed her girlfriend out in the tundra. Athena? Oh, you know Athena? Man, small world. Yeah, we were there when it happened. Fiona was Well, fuck. Then I don't know, maybe you could... Talk to Jenny, let her know what's what. Set her mind at ease if you can. That's a nice bike. You make that yourself? I did. It was gonna be a present for Athena when she got back. Oh. Yeah. Oh. She lied to me. Said she was on some... I really wanted to believe her. I did, but she forgot to turn her echo off the last time I spoke. Oh. I recognized your voice when you came in. You were out there with her. Her echo went dead after the fighting started. I couldn't... What was she doing? Why did she lie to me? I need to know. I know she wasn't on a delivery job. Why would she lie to me like that? Why would she leave? She was protecting us from Valerie. It's... It's my fault. If she hadn't been trying to keep me safe, they never would have gotten the drop on her. Oh. Are you angry at me? Kinda, yeah. But thanks for telling me. So what happened to her exactly? I've never seen Athena lose a fight. How'd she get grabbed? So long as she's got that shield. I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on her. It doesn't make sense. She can't... Two Vault Hunters ambushed her. Which ones? Brick and, uh... Mordecai. She would have beaten them too if Valerie hadn't attacked. Brick. Mordecai. 
Good to know. <laughs> this is kind of awkward. Change the subject. These nice ladies want us to build a rocket for them? What do you say? I don't know if I've got the parts. Sure you do. Come on. You just gotta I just to... want to know one last thing, and then I'll see about the rocket. Did she... say anything about me? Before they took her. The way she acted, sometimes I didn't even know if she liked me. She told me to mm. pass on a message. She said she loves you. She did? I... I... Oh, goodness. Okay. Oh, wow. Young lady, you are gonna have yourself a rocket. And once <laughs> I'm done building it, well, I'm gonna grab every gun I can carry, I'm gonna she drive out of here, she I'm says gonna she rescue my girlfriend, words, and I'm gonna marry the piss out of her. I'm in. I can probably build you something that'll break Atmo, but beyond that, you want a mechanic on board to make sure it doesn't explode on you. Oh man, that sounds like a job for the scooter man if I ever heard one. And considering yeah. it's a dream of mine to catch a ride into space and all that. Scooter, wanna come with? Be our onboard mechanic? You made it? Whoa, space buddies! God damn it. <clears throat> space buddies! That's so stupid. Here's how it's gonna The man with the plan right here is gonna track down the I get it. Off you go. All right, Reese. Let's just find Vasquez's body, get back here, and crap our pants. Oh, you <laughs> are gonna have such a hard on Reese. Sure. Phelps, oh. huge. Two out of three ain't bad. My office, not your hard on. Uh, back here again. Thought I'd close the book on this weird chapter of my life. Yeah, you better run. Up there is body. You see, I told you so. Wallet head. All right, wallet head. Time to show sure. your face back on Helios. Face, face is face. Has no face. Oh, you better hope a psycho didn't use it for a skin pizza. A skin pill. Go, go. Oh. Uh, uh, what were the pepperonis? Uh, a skin pill. Oh, you uh, clearly haven't been on Pandora mm -hmm. long enough, compadre. Uh -huh. Let's find Vasquez's face mm. and get out of here. You're the boss. All right, look. I said skin pieces between there. between you and me. That's in the past. Okay? It's almost like it never happened. Let's just drop it, okay? So we can focus on finding the face. Okie dokie, I'll drop it like a moonshot into a basket full of puppies. No problem. You gotta keep an eye on your friends during this Helios mission, huh? How you're not keeping an eye on that tripwire? Uh, what? Uh, well, looks like these psychos had themselves a little skin pizza party. Uh, how am I gonna find Vasquez's face? In all this mess. What the fuck? That's what an echo eyes for, genius. Scan the faces from a nice stab-free distance. Unless you 
want to get up close and physical with some new psycho pals. Scanning. Scanning. Ooh, Vasquez wasn't that ugly. You and me, Pumpkin, let's rock this walk. Whoa, this place is scaring me and I'm a frickin' hologram. Uh, careful now. I want to end up psycho dinner. Oof, disturbing. Not Vasquez's face disturbing, but still disturbing. Glad I wasn't invited to this pizza party. Disturb huh? sleep pattern? Oh, flawless! Not now. Rem Psycho! <laughs> Alright, good, good, again! This time with feeling! Give him the old smackdown! Atta boy! Smackdown. Big day tomorrow. You die, I sleep. Smacky dabby! I should punch with this arm more often. Okay, listen up, because I'm about to pull this. No one ever became a leader. Kinda looks like my ex-girlfriend. I'd actually be okay with that. Sorry, Stacy. Nope. Well, this is a fun night. There's Vasquez's face. Oh, looks like we are psycho. You only see this kind of thing on Pandora. Oh, give Jesus me back to Helios, Reese. Pretty please, with strippers on top. <laughs> Just rip it off like a bandage. Quick and painful. Oh, mm. Okay. Just peel it off. Peeling off the face. Not going to barf into his mouth. <laughs> with your mouth. <sighs> That's it, go on. Peel off that face like a serial killer. You're sick. This is so fucking weird. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, it's stuck. Mm -mm. Oh, God, that's so... That, that is just the, the grossest thing I've ever seen. Oh, God, I can't stop now. Oh, no, 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 no. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, oh pinch, pinch it off. Pinch it off. Oh, seriously? Oh, please don't do it. Please, please, please don't do this to me. Oh, <laughs> oh. <gasps> Smash the baby's face! Crunch its teeth! <laughs> Run! You're the only one running, pal! I can fly! So, once I snatched that face pizza, gross, I sprinted out of Old Haven. Hundreds, yeah. thousands of psychos chased me. Oh, really? That many? Couldn't even count them all. Technically, it was one psycho, but he had a bomb strapped to his chest that yeah. had a stopping power of like a thousand of which could. So, one. One. Yeah. Psycho with chest bomb. Boom! You said something about a bomb, psycho? Oh. Yeah. There. <laughs> Whoa, wait, dude. Oh, we were supposed to bring back the body. Oh, we are still bringing the face. It's just gonna take a little longer to collect now. Think I got some baggies in the truck. What the fuck? They got some baggies in the truck. What's <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> too stupid? <coughs> Boom. I was gonna say, why was Anthony Jack though, Peter Pan? He can fly! 
stupid S. I want to say it's a Peter Pan reference, but it probably hey, wasn't. Pretty. This one fits your also, budget. alive and not afraid. Yeah. Complete chapter two of episode necessary. four. Fiona should fit in on Helios, but you, Sasha? No way, man. Hey, here's your disguise allowance. Don't think it'll be a regular thing. Damn, I got so much money. Get yourself something or get Sasha something nicer so she'll quit whining. Don't care either way. Just don't look Pandora and start it. So, what are you gonna get, sis? Let's see what we're working with. Hey, Fiona, the, uh, the price you're optioning too shabby. Plus, I kind of want you to spend all of August's money. Hey. Or whatever. Just pick something that says I look like a stuck-up jerk. Yeah, <laughs> that'll work. I do it for Sasha. Yeah, let's do it for Sasha. All right. All right, thanks, V. I'll try it on in a bit. Hope it's worth the cash. Could have bought a lot of guns with that. Let's see. What inflammability? Wow. And I kind of, I kind of like the, I kind of like this, but I also like this. Let's go as a steampunk princess. I don't know. I can either go with this. High flying Hyperion. You know, mm, this is actually a tough choice. You know, I really like the steampunk outfit, but for the sake of the mission. Just so you don't look high, just so we, we blend in. Should probably look more Hyperion. So that's all we're doing. Ooh, that'll look good. Are you both blind? Scooter. You look like a dream. You're up, Sash. Make it quick. Not impressing anyone with this, but it's all right. <laughs> you almost finished with that? Yep, I'm done. I'm not even going to ask. Better that way. I should with this something hey, nice, hey. but screw it. Is this disguise gonna work? I figure you're the one with the eye for this. You and Vaughn are the only Hyperion I know. Suits you. Is that a pun? Oh no, <laughs> that is. I get it. Um, I'm just saying that it looks very convincing. It's a good look for you. Thanks. I'm gonna be burning these clothes once this is over. Naturally. Anyway, it's all yours. Thanks. Scan my. Severed face here. Have fun with that. Just get to the skin screen and... Please scan skin. Oh, there we go. Okay, skin scan. Oh, God. Oh, God. Much worse from the side. Oh. Skin unlocked. Oh, that's 
amazing. Is it? Yeah, I mean, you look like a complete douchebag. Excellent. Yeah. That is the look I was going for. This is... Oh, definitely weird. Well, it's certainly... big. That's scooter for ya. Sure. I hope Vaughn's alright. I'm just looking out for him. We'll track them down and get back. Probably should have got her in a nicer outfit, but screw it. Oh my god, are you shitting me? <laughs> are you shitting me? Space boys. We're j I like how we were in chapter two or chapter one. Maybe we past chapter one. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> They're stupid. It's like funny as shit. <laughs> Already just for that. So that's like too far. See you, Pete. Show you towards August. Let's see this. Hey, you look like you've done that. Like you've done that before. I know it's where we're from, but... It's never felt like home to me. I... I never see this. It looks so... I don't... Peaceful. It puts things in... Everything that we've gone through, it all seems so small from up here. It's... It's a shame we... Wish we could just turn towards the nearest planet. Probably run out of fuel, so it's... Uh, but... We won't have to. We'll be whichever planet we want. <laughs> Wait. 
I keep forgetting they're here. Once we get the beacon, we'll figure out how to turn things back in our favor. Any ideas on how exactly we do that? Or are we just winging it? Again. Eh, we wing it. <laughs> of course we do. When you're good at something, why stop? Hey, watch it. Oh, sorry, man. Just got a wife for me is all. It ain't bleeding or nothing. What the hell is this damn thing? It's, uh... Well, it's a satellite. Gonna launch it to, to advertise my franchise. You know what they say. I ain't no ad space like outer space. Of all the brands, you pick the one Hyperion hates. We're not drawing more attention to ourselves for some publicity stunt. Hey, there's no need for that. Stop it! Come on, man. I gotta get some out of this trip. Scooter's earned the right to cash in on this trip. If it weren't for him, we'd still be stuck down on Pandora. And August, what exactly have you done for this mission? I thought. Ah, oh, whatever. Awesome! That's a bad idea. Well, no one asked you. Warning. Brief collision. <laughs> Is that a... person? Hey! Oh, like other zones are chilling on the thing. Henderson. Impact detected on center rocket booster. No shit. Tell us something you don't know. Did you know Ch the damage is critical? So this is how I die. I knew it. I knew it. Um, how critical exactly? Without additional thrust. So it's real bad. Pretty bad. Yeah. Look, y'all, we need to do some right here, and y'all are in luck, because that's my specialty. Now turn yeah, your mother rockets up to 11. Oh, oh man, I got like, I want to save that full thrust. Things coming off the thing. That's normal. This is normal? Yeah, we're running like real hot right now. Real hot right now. What we gotta do? Listen, it's our only shot. Okay, we're about to hit escape velocity. When we do, you gotta shut these behind. Yeah, yeah, I hear. Do you? How can you hear anything? Achieving escape velocity. Five, four, three, two, one. Go! <laughs> You done it. So then why are the alarms still going? Now nah, that was just step one. We can't do step two without step one. Booster rocket failure imminent. What does that mean? They're going to explode. Step two, let's do this! Uh, when are they gonna explode? Very soon. Everyone stay calm. We got this. Ah, there's the girl I fell in love with. What? Huh? 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 Ah, don't you worry your pretty little bit bit death, but yourself by I'll be one. I was like, it's episode already. I don't know. Sure, it's like five. Alright, I'll go that way towards the rocket and I'll take care of the other one. Listen, we ain't got much time. Be careful, Fee. That's right. Climb to the unstable rocket. Oh, this seems dangerous. God damn it. I meant to grab it, but apparently they don't want me to grab it. 
That's right. Easy does it. Made it. All right, now see that panel there that keeps opening and shutting? Uh, dangerous looking one? Yeah, that's it. Now there's a yellow button in there that you gotta push. That's step one. Right. The button wedged all the way in the back. Oh, you got it? All right. No! What? <laughs> when you press it, you gotta pull your arm out real quick because it's gonna clamp down something fierce. You got me? Be careful. You're almost there. You. <clears throat> Left rocket stable, Fiona. All right. Now pull the last to detach that sucker while we still can. <laughs> I don't know. God damn it, Scooter. <laughs> Can't do step two without step. No! Guess not quite as long as I thought. Guys, that rocket's at critical. You gotta hurry. <laughs> no conversating on this one. No, no, I, I can pull you out. Listen, there ain't nothing you can do that I ain't already tried, okay? No. Screw the lie. Uh, what's going on out there? Nothing. Don't you worry. Fiona's got this. Hey. Hey. You gotta go over there, pull that latch, and cut this rocket loose. There's no time for anything else, you understand? No, stop, okay? There's gotta be some other way out of this. No, there ain't. Even if there was, there's no time. This baby's gonna blow, okay? That is happening. And you can't be here when it does. Now, don't you go feeling all sorry for me, all right? People on Pandora will be talking about an old scooter for a long time. Can't think of a more epic way to go. You're a hero. You know that, right? I kinda am, huh? Well, Scooter will never forget you. Right rocket is way past critical, guys. You have to do it. Had to do it. If it was going to be his last memory, you had to do it. Because he's going to catch a ride. All right, y'all. It's probably the end, but you see Moxie or Ellie, you tell him I did some awesome shit. Okay? It's been real. Watch him survive. the first casualty of the mission.
First casualty, aka Scooter Deb. So, what did you do next? What did we do? We honored him as we could. We earned this. It's the least we can do. Make it something good. It's the least we can do. Gotta do catch a ride. What it is like to lose someone you care about. Part is. I well, that's August, actually. Screw us. He deserves so much better. He was definitely one of the nicest people I met on Pandora. Although that's not probably saying much. Anyway, we didn't have much time to mourn and all that. Things started to get crazy the minute we landed on Helios. So, uh, if that's not it, uh, answering. Perfect. You have entered Hyperion airspace. Identify yourselves immediately. Okay, gang. There we go. I repeat, identify yourselves or you will be shot down. Will he be shot down? Do not come any closer. It's Hugo Vasquez. I'm back. Hugo, huh? I guess we should roll out the red carpet. Uh, for starters, yeah, I'd also like some bubbly chilling in my office. Just, uh, not too cold, mind you. How about a warm bucket of piss? <laughs> You're lucky good old Hugo has a sense of humor. Ooh, this is where stuff start going to shit. Get inside and disable security. I'll call you when it's safe to come out. Time to put on the game face. Chuck. You've got some things to answer for. Vasquez. Almost seems like, uh, what's the word? Well, how's it hanging, fellas? Another glorious day working for the big H in the sky, am I right? How are you kids? Still non-existent. You nailed it! That was a test. Well done! <laughs> Orders are to verify what the hell you were doing down on Pandora. Nah, take it easy, guys. I just landed. In a hunk of Pandoran trash, no less. With half a loader bot stuck to the top. And what's that thing you dropped say? Catch a... Uh... Whatever the hell it says, it was a doll saddle. Now I suggest you start with before I blow your head off. So, what were you doing? Not too often the top brand at dirt pile. I was dealing with the and uh, Vaughn situation. The who and what situation? Reese and Vaughn, the two criminal masterminds who had the gall to try to rip off the corporation that nurtured them. One of them's really handsome. Hmm. Sounds made up. Yeah, but I got, you know, very important places to be. So he's part of Hyperion, by the looks of it. What am I like? Nah. What do you mean, nah? Here's how it is. You come up here full of piss and bullets with some made-up story about Reese and Vaughn characters. So no, you're not going anywhere. I'll take it from here. Mm. 
Ebat, so good to see you. We need to catch up. Bring it in for testing. Oh shit. They're dead. What the hell happened to Reese? This is unbelievable. Could we talk somewhere that's less exposed? We're fine right here. I'd like to shed more light on the situation. The situation is that you brought Reese back in pieces. Our deal was clear. You were supposed to retrieve his head so management could download whatever the hell was inside of there that was so damn valuable. Now we'll never collect the reward. Because you lost a critical Hyperion asset. Deal? What deal? It's a little late to play dumb, Hugo. So we agreed that I'd bring you Reese's head? This is priceless. You had one job, and, well, you blew it. We really have blow it. I'm taking you straight to management. Let's see how you like answering to them. I've had it with you. Let's see how big of a smart ass you are under questioning. Fine, I'm sure they'll also want to hear about the ten million dollars you embezzled with your friends. That's right. I've got eyes and ears everywhere. That sounded weird, but you know what I mean. I have no idea what you're talking about. I think you do. This is far from over. Sure, it's far from over. Ain't my first radio. Chapter 3 is episode 4. Yeah, let's play. Linked. That's word. Alright, alright. You wanna dance? Let's dance. Killer. Good luck keeping up the pace, though. Bet that little cyber arm of yours is getting pretty tired. It's child's play, right, pal? Well, the security is a bit tougher than I expected. I know, I wrote the program. Let's send an icebreaker into that frozen sea of code, shall we? What? Jack's hat. Fuck it. We have to. It's not the royal we decide. Uh -huh. Security cameras have been breached. Now, go forth and lay waste, my son. Just one sec. Let me find you. There they are. Fiona, I'm in. Nice work. Yeah, if I do say so myself. Uh, the door's up ahead. Come on, this way. Found them. Okay, we're at the hub of heroism. Great. The elevator. Is across the atrium. It's where the tours meet. Got it. Looks like it on our tour guide hat. We only need their badge, and then we're out of here. Although I could use a new hat. Mm -hmm. Pretending to be a tour guide for a place we've never been and know nothing about. This'll end well. Pow! Oh, oh my God. Got the finger. It's just
You gotta take a chance to steal some cash. You ready for this? I was fabricated, programmed, and wired ready. I was also built to dance. <laughs> I was a built to dance. God dang it, so stupid at this point. Handsome Jack Memorial and Tor. It's like they worship him. The hell are you doing here? Motivational speaker. Said my gun doesn't talk. Do your job, or you'll hear what she has to say. That voice, that Lee. I feel like that's Lee. I'm walking dead, but I can't tell. I can't tell. About our tour guide yet? Not yet. Reese, you need an assist. All right, check in the schedule. Check in the All right, a guide will be coming off our tour any second. We're on it. Nope, not a tour guide. All right, there's a tour guide. Standard distract and grab. Yeah, a tour guide. First opening I find, I'll lift her badge. Oh, 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 what about me? Oh, you've got the most important job of all, Gordis. Once I have the badge, you gotta get the tour guide out of the room. Roger that, General Captain Ma'am. Private Gordon on the job. believe they call that stuff in the cafeteria food? <laughs> That's why I stick to coffee. Hides the whiskey on my breath. A woman after my own heart? Ugh, I've been thinking. If Hyperion served real food, not that free hyperhydrated crap. Helios tours and you're superior. Got it you though. Some respect, robot. Oh, time out, time out. You just watched Gordas get berated by Sasha and you didn't grab the badge, and the whole plan failed. I feel dumb. I didn't realize you had to grab actually grab it. I feel completely dumb. That's <laughs> so stupid. Well, that is the first spell of this game. Out of the whole game, that makes three. One, one more, and that's one poor episode, you might as well say. I feel dumb. I didn't really. Oh, no, this is so terrible. Nothing gets coffee and whiskey out. You. Do you have any idea who this is? A uh, nice tour guide lady? The tour guide lady. She's the head of all he. Come on, I'll help you find a change of clothes. You know, have you ever considered a management position? I mean, the way you demean that little robot, you'd be perfect. Where do I put in my application? Hello, Reese. You have the privilege of speaking to Helios's newest tour guide. Well done. Yep, I would hide it because it doesn't match I'm heading your... up to Jack's office with Gordis. Hi, Reese! Oh, damn it. What? What's happening? They know they've been hacked. I got this, but you need to hurry and keep a low profile. <sighs> okay. Keep your eyes on the prize. Yeah, that's where low profile needs to be kept. Attention. What the Yo, fuck? I don't like their faces. They aren't moving. 
Who's this? Uh, she barely looks Hyperion. Mm, pretty. Ah, uh, nice masks. Oh, you think I'll prefer Promethean knockoffs? This is the Handsome Jack VIP experience, baby. Right. So, are you gonna give us the tour or not? Oh. Uh. You've kept us waiting long enough. All right. VIPs. Well, get ready for a once in a lifetime experience for all of us. Here we go. Here we go. The uh, first stop of the Handsome Jack VIP experience. This depicts. Oh, I cannot wait to hear about this. Ooh. Ah. Mr. Hyperion. Defeating. Um. So that's why this company is called Hyperion. I get it now. That makes so much more sense. The entire army of Gremtilius by rolling over it with a giant eyeball. <sighs> what a mess. Whoa. You are totally blowing my mind right now. Quite totally a blown. sight to behold, isn't it? This, my friends, is... No freaking way. An epic mount that Jack rode into every single battle. And, uh... I wonder if Jack even rode that horse into space battles. That sounds dangerous and awesome. Whoever rides this horse granted three wishes. All three of Jack's wishes, naturally, were for more guns. Oh, ingenious. If you'll follow me, Just we're on to our third funny. and final exhibit. Oh, I can't wait. Um, uh, yeah, what is this? Ooh. Uh, kind of just looks like a chair. This, ladies and gentlemen, is Jack's chair. His chair champion. He made every great decision from this God dang it. He ate brunch, lunch, and dinner. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing at this too hard. The back of his diamond pony to prance into battle. Also, Thrash Mac 99, aka my friend Levi, I thank Sorry you for the host. Had to leave my chair for a throne. I appreciate it, man. Wait a minute. That wasn't an exhibit at all. So, why? I think they call people like that liar. That was a test, people. And you failed. Wait, what? How does that work? All right, enough of chit chat. Come on through so you can see Jack's office. Do we really have to see Jack's office? I mean, come on. No one likes Jack's office. I'm gonna need you to step aside and raise your arms. Ho oh, ho, I knew there was something off about her. Yeah, she was weirdly ignorant for a guy. Yeah, I don't trust her. You're welcome There's... for the awesome tour. Awesome? Yeah, it seemed like you just made a half of it. You ungrateful I really? poser. Yeah, <laughs> okay. If posing as handsome Jack is a crime, then find me guilty. What's this? I mean, it basically is a crime. It was a gift. What's in it? Look for yourself. No metal objects. Next time, it's mine. Understood. No idea what it is. Woo -woo. <laughs> still still don't know what there. it is. Now for the main event. Even you can't ruin this for me. Uh -huh. I'm pretty sure she can run anything for everyone, so... As no one knows the badge, she looks nothing like her. Like, that's like a big flaw in this plan right now. Stop! Why? Oh, boy. I... I... I can't believe we're here. 
Uh, here it is. Your hero's office. Is it safe to go inside? Uh. Gotta be. I paid good money for this. Uh-uh. I want the full handsome Jack VIP experience. That means going all the way. Uh, I really wouldn't. Yeah, you know what? We don't need your permission. Force field breach detected. Security lockdown engaged. Thank you for taking the oh my god. Jack oh. VIP oh experience. God. This isn't a we tour. Hope you enjoyed it's a your goddamn tour. death trap. Goodbye. Okay, uh, let's go. Everybody out. I mean, to be fair, she told him not to go I'm in. Not cleaning that shit up again. You got this. We told him not to. That's a heavy duty looking door. This better work. Damn it. I can't get into Jack's office. What? You gotta be kidding me. You had one job! Oh, come on! Oh, come on! Some moron on the tour tried to go through before the door was deactivated. I, I, I can't seem to get in. I mean, the, the lockdown system must be on a local grid or something. Now, so I can understand. It means other way in. Whatever that other way in may be. I just need to think about a second and... Uh, maybe if... Um, hold tight, I gotta call you back. Events here. Crap. Well, shit. He said to hold tight. <laughs> Gordas, Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna question that at all. Damn it. <laughs> Newsflash, asshole. This is my office my now. First you give me a body that isn't recent, then you go hacking my computer doing Well shit. You're trying to pull something. I know it. Oh hey, Evac. Glad you came by. Just cleaning up my computer. Spare me the sarcasm. You wanna tell me what's going on? We had a deal, asshole. I tracked recent bonds all across Pandora for you. I refused oh, to Oh shit. When I needed them. And all you had to do was bring me whatever the hell was living inside Reese's head. I knew I shouldn't have trusted you. Of course you betrayed me. You're only out for yourself. You traitor. Oh, grow up. It's just an office. But you still haven't answered me. She doesn't even realize what I mean. Why bring a body that wasn't Reese? I can't believe you thought I wouldn't find... Well, you seriously estimated me. I made a mistake. The firefight got messy. I must have grabbed the wrong dead guy. You grabbed the wrong... They look the same when their face is a big puddle. I have no idea what's going on here, but I don't like it. I'm calling security. Well, sh security. You are don't if I was you unless you want to be a bunch. Hey, jerk. Yeah. Time to decide what's mightier, the pen or the punch. Are busy. Please continue Talk it out or stun her. A reminder, if you Talk it out. By gunfire, please hang up and dial emergency medical services. Feels like the better hey, idea man. here to talk it out. We need to talk. Oh, yeah? What about? You got this, pal. Don't mess it up. Die. Security officers are busy eliminating other threats and will take your call in the order it was received. You're going to want to put that phone down. Who's that? Oh, I don't know. Maybe you should ask Henderson. Oh, wait. You can't because I threw his ass out of an airlock. Come on. You're not really going to do that, are you? There's a ton of security nearby. I wouldn't push my luck if I were you. I like hurting people, of that it's my favorite perk next to the snack room in my big ass office. Oh wait, you took my office. Now all I got left are snacks and pain. Oh shit. I um I'll, I'll give you a little more time. I'll show I'm you. I'm watching you. I wouldn't have it any Hey, we didn't fuck it up. Fiona, you there? Reese, what took you so long? Years is tomorrow. Oh, you know, a mission. Like I ran into on. an old friend, who I guess is a new enemy. <laughs> wow, everyone is trying to screw you over. Oh, I have all the luck, don't I? 
So yeah, Jack's office is on total lockdown, and I can't get the beacon. Little help? Uh, oh no. I'm working on it. Well, work faster. No beacon means no more. Means everybody's gonna die. At least we're all. Everybody's <laughs> gonna die. That's fucked up. Come on, Reese, it'll come to you. You know, if I were you in there with the vet, the stun baton do the talking. Well, that's not quite true. If I were you, I would have bought Yvette a one-way ticket to Haitian town. Yvette's got nothing to do with this, all right? Just leave her alone. Oh, excuse me. Who said anything about... Oh, wait, are you talking to Jack? I'm not psyched about it, but yeah, it's Jack. Well, just let me know if he goes evil and you need me to shoot you in the head. Will do. <laughs> As I was saying, I'm I mean, here to he, he, I mean, just he wouldn't even if he could. Jack fan like you doesn't know I... Because he can't. So there's that. And let me tell you, you're gonna love it. As long as blood doesn't make you squeamish and yeah, maybe some brains and whatnot. Just, 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 just to make sure, this trap door uh, is it a way out door or an instant death trap? You know, I like to think of it as the best of both worlds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but am I gonna so die instant death when I go and escape? You no, know, nice. I'd be insulted if I didn't know you better. Which is it? It's the key to our whole plan. You're going to need to go in the out hole while someone yanks the lever. It's not as sexy as it sounds. A lot of people died down there. No, oh, what did I agree to? A brilliant plan. Office on lockdown, climbing up the trap door is the only way in. And you get it makes to do it sense. all from the safety of a prison cell. I mean, I I've heard of some killer plans in my time, but this one takes the... No, no way. Forget it. This plan is insane. Coming up here in a rocket caravan with cheap muscle and a couple of con artists. That was freaking insane. I'm just trying to make sure we both survive this a point. mess of yours. That's so all I gotta say. Okay, then. So I hate Hanson Jack. Has a plan. Yeah, he's just a fucking that's... asshole. All right, the first step, though, is to make he sure has that a con point. artist babe of yours joins you on the prison level and we're golden. You can access the jack hole there. Cool. <laughs> That's a worse name than a glory hole. Like, what? It's a jack hole, glory hole, except for jacking off and not getting sucked so, off or something. Jack hey, Jesus Christ! Pearls of wisdom. Yeah, more or less. Let's hear it. Hey, Fee, you have got to see the head tour guide's office. The view is unbelievable. Not now. We got to change the plan. What's up? You need to get down to the prison level. Got it. On my way. All right. Wait, how? Clearance for that? Oh, uh, right. Uh, I don't, uh, just get arrested. Did? Yeah, that's the exact opposite of what we've been trying to just do. it and do it quick. I gotta go. <laughs> All right. We do this Pandoran style. Hey! Hey! Being bitchy whenever you're just trying to. up this awful paint. I'm ready for prison life! That's official hype property you just defaced! We found Is the map? The no, let me look at just one sec. No, that is mine! Hey! Hey, I'll, I'll split it with you! Maybe it wasn't what, what the you fuck? thought it was. I know a treasure. Like, I'm like, like, I'm holding his hand. Like, it's nothing. Like, it's common. What the fuck? <laughs> so stupid. I told you, just get arrested and meet me. Reese, are you there? Vaughn? Vaughn? Hey, I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm with Cassius. He saved me back there, and we're just... I don't know where, but... We're eating drake fruit. Really wanna What's the Bon? What's the thing? Bon? Oh shit. Ew fuck. Talk or walk, ladies. I don't have time for both. You made me and my accounting boys look like idiots with that ten million you stole. It's gonna take years to do all the paperwork. Better up to it. <clears throat> Here's the malfunctioning. Sorry, just ate a burrito. Never mess with accountants, Vasquez. 
can always count on us outnumbering you. Smoke them. Smoke them. How exactly is she gonna smoke us? When you realize this is just a freaking game to him. What the fuck is going on here? Got him now. Get him! What? Bring it up! What's up? It's like the biggest. <laughs> it's so stupid. It's like the most There's epic game of. I don't know what you would call it. I honestly don't know what you would call it. You're not finger banging. Bitch. Finger banging. Ooh. Secret agent. There you go. That's what it. That's that's what it's like. <laughs> Fast account. Definitely a virgin. The fuck? <laughs> That's a late death. <laughs> And we beat the accountants. Hey, Light this you candle. Episode four. Even if it was a treasure map, it's not gonna do it down here. Mm -hmm. uh, here. Hi, Reed. Things are going great. Did you just see? Something. And are blown. Hey. I'm Vasquez. What a stupid road. Am I right? Wait, yeah, Gordis is a her? Upstairs, she's not the brightest tool in the shed. That doesn't make sense. Quiet! So what is with Mr. Gaz? Because if it's on the incident upstairs, this is all under control. Yeah, I've got some heavy interrogation ahead of me with this Pandoran scum. Interrogation. Oh yeah, you don't do whatever they do. I'd get some interrogation for your trouble. You know what I'm saying? Guess so. Go on and grab some lunch or something. I hear the macaroni. But I got this. Dude, I, I could go for some macaroni right now. Let me know if you need anything. Nice job. Now, why would you go out of your disguise? I, I didn't mean it. I was just acting. I know. You acting me. It's okay. Why is my heart breaking right now? <laughs> so, what is this Never exactly? Remember. Jack told me about a trap door that leads to his. We just gotta figure out a way up. What the fuck? Oh, he found that way up. So I'm guessing the plan doesn't involve you getting most by a death machine? No, that's... that's a problem. By figuring out a way to shut that thing off so I can I pull you up on the comm so you can identify the piece. That all 
like a plan. Wait, we gotta go up that scary dark hole? I think Reese is the only one scrawny enough to fit. Phew! Whew, glad I got these meaty. Hey, Gordis, you, uh, you wanna go first? Huh? Yeah. No, thank you! Well, aren't robots supposed to obey orders or something? That does her about like a fun place, huh? No one single. I was joking. Damn. That's what I meant. Hope you hot for you one of it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh god. Me! Me! I wanna try food! I'm tired of eating electricity all the time. It tickles! Oh I forgot. No, I can't mop up my thing. Let's see. I have no idea what the fuck to hit. Ooh, that death trap sure looks deadly. You know, it's deadliness and all. Just think of it like a big blender. Everyone loves smoothies. Yum! People flavor. Mm, oh my god, this robot's like a killer, killing killer or some shit. In disguise. Oh, okay. Why didn't I see that before? It's like I had to look at everything and all of a sudden this just showed up. Alright. Got it. On a timer. Alright, I get it now. So, Fiona, I need some. Well, Gordas boosts me up. Don't worry, just. Well, I mean, Gordas technically. I someone made a medal. Oh no, excruciating people, but it happened to you. Reese wouldn't let us down. Oh, you haven't been around him as long as I have. How could you possibly doubt? Possibly die. Oh, okay, are you are you are you moving? Not even a little. I got this. Looks like it. All right, Gordis, just give me a little boost up there. No problem. You say are little you boost. Okay. <laughs> How was that? Better. I did. Thanks. You say no little boost. Problem. Try not to die. Good thing I got that puking out of my system. Maybe we should step away. Reese, you can do it. Climbing with your cyber arm should be easy. Easy, right? <laughs> Stupid, nice. Right, robot. climbing that's an easier cyber arm. You've got some impeccable timing. Hey, I don't know when you gave them the slip, but Finch and Kroger are out there looking for you, and things are gonna get messy if you start messing with us. Don't forget what's on the line here. You get us what we want, what we agreed to. Look, we had to change plans. There were... complications. Well, let me uncomplicate it. Get the beacon. Bring... Working on it. Good. Or we get the beacon and put it on Gordis and say, fuck you all. And we made it. It's probably into chapter six, I would assume. But I could be wrong. Yep, no matter where you go, complete chapter six four. <laughs> Check you out, you made it. In the end, we make a pretty good huh? I mean, we had our differences, but we got my eyes. Hey, Jack. Hey, Jack. I made it here without you. Hey. He's not lying there. Same to you, man. Wow. I used to dream about being here. Anyway, where's the Gorda speaking? Uh, it's got to be over there somewhere. It's where all the corporate warfare fallout is. Ton of Atlas crap. Soak it in, kid. Enjoy yourself. Damn. Yeah, there's really no rush here. Just take it easy. Soak in the sights. Okay, I'm not even gonna actually look. I'm just like... Fuck it. I would talk, but... Well, 
Welcome to my trophy case. Huh? Got a couple of killer relics. A few artifacts. Oh, there's a stock certificate signifying that I own Atlas. So, no beacon by the looks of it. Nothing feels better than crushing mind, your stealing some of weapons. to the point where you can buy all their shares with pocket change. <sighs> Delish. Gordas, you there? Uh, hi. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to show you the pieces now. You let me know which one it is. All right? Okie dokie. Devin, not to shot. Definitely not that sexy hat. I'm so excited to find my missing piece! If anything, sis. I hope the beacon looks super cute on me, huh? So this means... You own Atlas? Yep, that's right. I own the whole shebang. This way I've got the option of building them back up to destroy all over whenever <laughs> Cowgirl. Yeah, I don't uh, have a cowboy hat. Uh, that was my girl hat. Well, her first one before one. she became a sexy badass sheriff type chick. <laughs> he suited her. What the fuck? Oh, found it. I think that's it. Why did I see that first? Great. I'll it. Not much to look at. Okay, here we go. The big seat is all yours. You trigger the trap door from there. And this is where I died, probably. And with that gorgeous thing, we should be able to still open the vault, right? I mean. Probably a bad idea, because this is where Jack probably ends up stealing your whole system. Feels good. That'd be the contact activated dopamine injectors. You look like somebody who could kill a bunch of people with a phone call and a little bit of bass in your voice. So tell me how to trigger the trap door. It's behind your pinky. This could be our last chance to chat, you and I. For years, I ruled Hyperion from this shit. and now you're here, where it all started. How's it feel, kiddo? There's something to be said for a cushy chair with a bunch of big important buttons that can raise hellfire on people. It's good to be the king. I knew there was a reason we got I had when I sat in would you? Oh, I try to do good, obviously, but that's not a choice. What the hell is taking him so long? Reese, the machine is off. Did you get the beacon? We're ready for you. All good. Just getting into position. Oh! Someone is here! Hey! Oh, it's you! What are you doing? Gordas, come back over. Take the broom, hold it, it's probably gonna go down regardless. Probably not gonna hold. Someone's probably gonna die here. Here she is. Oh shit. That's not good so, at all. If we could wield Hyperion's mic together, how would you rule? Hypothetical. Of course, but still. No, it's not. Cause you want. If you're gonna make it, kid. Like I told you after we escaped Old Haven. Remember? Fix Pandora. There's some good people down there. They deserve better than a world full of psychos. Yeah, that's what I wanted. But hell, maybe you'll pull it off. Who knows? You've done well so far, kid. But imagine, Reese, if it wasn't hypothetical. You ever wonder why Nakayama created me? This whole 
AI thing. I was supposed to find a worthy successor to the Hyperion throne. What she never that successor, did. Reese, is you. If you join me, we can rule together. What do you say, kid? This is the only room with the override port, so if you don't jack in now, oh. you'll never get another shot. Hell no. You're a psychopath. Why would I trust you? After I have to all do the it time, too. Yeah. I tried to help you after all we've been through. Use everything you've ever wanted. Oh, I knew you were an idiot the moment you plug me into your empty little head. Yeah, sure, sure. Call me kiddo a billion times and laugh at your own jokes. I should have never brought you back. So annoying. Oh, I'm annoying? Am I annoying now? How about now? Am I annoying now? How about now? Am I annoying? <laughs> well, you haven't even seen me try to get under your skin yet, kiddo. I'm done talking. I'm using the trapdoor. No. No, you really not. Probably should have accepted it. Reese, machine is off. Did you get the beacon? We're ready for you. Oh, you really shouldn't have told Fiona. All good. Let's Just get getting into position. position. What are you doing? <laughs> And that's where it's proof. Jack's come back. Well, that shit's done. I'm everywhere in the system now. Not to mention my sweet new body. You're a maniac. No, I am handsome, goddamn Jack. 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 That's going to happen anyway. Told you, psych told you he's psychopath. Also, achievement! There you are. Complete episode four. It's a you and fit. Wow. You and 52.1% of players honored Scooter with his catchphrase. You have to catch a ride. You and 60.7% of players tried to stop the tour group from dying. You and wow, that's the majority. Jeez, or my minority. You and twenty eight point or twenty eight point three percent of players deface the price of painting. You and twenty eight percent of players reveal Hanson Jack's assistance. You wow, I'm in a minority on this game a lot. You and twenty talked you vet down. Probably should have done that, or probably shouldn't have. Probably should have used someone. And you and fifty two percent of players chose to reject Hyperion. So it's wow. See, the first two on Fiona I'm not surprised by. And the last one I'm not surprised by. But the other three, the last one on Fiona and the first two on Re Reese, I'm not surprised. Anyway, that, that, that's actually interesting. When the truces of Dewey's benefit, a white lie may smooth things over, but for how long? Never, day one ever, but it's still kind of like, wow. But anyway, that does it for episode four of Tales from the Board. Um, tomorrow I might be back for episode five because I was going to stream after this one. So I might, what the fuck? System. Wow. But I'm going to assume episode five, I'll be back for that. Hopefully within the week, because I do want to finish this game. Because I like it. I mean, it's, it's Telltale games. I like all Telltale games. But, um... Yeah. Like I said, I don't know. I like all Telltale games. It's more interesting... In this is interesting to me compared to some of the other ones. But the other ones to me are like... You don't... It's, it's intertwined so much with, like, all everyone. It's just interesting. So... Yeah. Again, either tomorrow night... Or sometime within the week... I will be back with... with episode 5. I would do it tonight but honestly I don't want you to do it tonight so yeah. But I hope you guys enjoyed this stream. Tales in Borderlands episode 3 and 4 and until next time guys live free and rock.
I was right. Troy Baker and Moore Bailey. I knew Troy Baker. I had a feeling that's them. Those two are in so many games, Sunny Funny, especially all the telephone games. Now time to look free enough. You can take what you want from me 